Family Fun Center. Let's go in. In today's Kim's Adventure, we head out to the Rogue Valley Family Fun Center, Southern Oregon's number one destination for family entertainment. Established in 1996, they opened their doors right after Thanksgiving, and the outside attractions were an instant hit. A few months later, they finished the arcade building and the rest was history. They offer a three-story soft play structure, over 70 state-of-the-art video games, go-karts, bumper boats, miniature golf, batting cages, and a full-service snack bar. Let's get ready to play some miniature golf. I really liked how the building was styled like an old western town. Here they got, they got golf, they got go-karts, bumper boats, batting cages, and the Cactus Jack's Playhouse. And you can get the fun pack for $30, junior fun pack for $25, there's a special for $20, kitty special for $16, and driver bundle for $30. Okay, alright, Dylan's gonna play some miniature golf here. There's a $40 cash prize, but I will be keeping track of Dylan's score. Do your best, Dylan! The Family Fun Center comes equipped with two 18-hole miniature golf courses. The troop leader incentivizing the kids with $40 was a great way to make the game a little more spicy. Even though every kid had a different level of ability, I observed these boys encouraging each other to do their best. Team building at its finest. But even with nope. all the positive vibes, nope. Dylan wasn't doing too good, and his anger got the nope. best of him. All right, concentrate, concentrate. Nope. Oh. Well, I mean, it's all right. It's all right. All right, just practice your strength. How hard do you have to hit it to get in the house? Nope. What's wrong with you, bro? What the heck? You tripping, bro? You tripping? Nope. Hey, Dylan, don't do that. If you don't want to play right, you don't have to play. But don't lose the ball. You lost your ball, huh? All right, your game's done. You don't have a ball anymore. Yeah, look, you can look for your ball, but if you can't find it, you're done. Your game's done. You gotta just watch other people play. You didn't go in the water, then where'd it go? All right, just keep looking for it then. You got nothing else to do because you can't play. You don't have a ball. You hit his ball. Yeah, but you hit it out of anger. That's why you can't be angry. You got to be patient. But worst of all, you cost me money. And now you don't have a full game. <laughs> we found his ball later, and I gave him a good pep talk between father and son. He pulled it together and started having fun and making some of his shots. Oh, two! When we finally finished our first round, the troop leader tallied up the score and presented the cash prize to the winner. Wait, who won? Who won? Who won? Who won? Irvin. Irvin, oh, come on! Great. You gotta do a celebration! Oh yeah, nothing like some cold hard fiat currency to sweeten the pot. Good job! You can now pay the gas for the ride back home. We then went inside to play some games in Southern Oregon's biggest and best arcade. Looking at these boys reminded me of when I was a kid playing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with my friends. Life sure has gone full circle.
And if you have young ones, don't forget about Cactus Jack's Playhouse, a three-story tall soft playhouse structure. It has slides, tunnels, web crawls, twists, tangles, and a toddler-only section. Prices are $5 of unlimited play and $3.50 after 6 p.m. Must be no taller than 56 inches. The Rogue Family Fun Center is also the most rented birthday party venue in the region. Reservations can be made Monday through Friday from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. We were finally ready for the best part of the day when the kids got to pick their prizes. Dylan went for the giant clown glasses. I'm not sure that would be my first choice, but okay. There was still more attractions to go on, but we ran out of time. Speed through the straightaways, dart around corners, and race your friends in Northwest Longest Go-Kart Track. Drivers must be at least 56 inches tall and at least 18 years of age. Feel like you're island hopping in their tropical themed bumper boats that comes equipped with a steering wheel that shoots streams of water. Drivers must be at least 44 inches tall and at least 3 years of age to ride. Or practice your swing in one of their 8 batting cages with slow softballs to very fast baseballs. Helmets and bats are provided. Well, we had a great time in our father and son camping trip to Medford, Oregon. The next day, it was time to drive all the way back to Los Angeles. We are almost home! Great. Stuck in traffic, but it's only about 10 more miles until we're home. It was a long trip. We drove all the way from Oregon down to LA, but I'm so happy. And uh, you know what? Tiring trip, but I think we got a lot of good experiences along the way and uh, memories that we made. So, this is me signing off on another Kim's adventure. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, here's some more suggestions. And as always, please like, subscribe, and press the bell for notifications, and I'll see you on the next Kim's Adventure.